All right, we're going to get to the next story, man. This story is crazy as hell. There was a woman in her 60s and her dog who were stabbed to death in a horrifying broad daylight attack in California's park by a 23-year-old killer who was then knocked unconscious by a bystander who threw a rock. It says the woman has not been named and it is unclear what type of dog she had. Um, anyway, it says they were walking in Long Hill Park in San Dimas near L.A. yesterday. The attacker first grabbed the dog's leash from the woman and stabbed the animal. He then stabbed her repeatedly before someone else knocked him unconscious. The attacker was taken to a hospital and he will be charged with murder when he is woke up and released. <laughs> Hey, man, people are going damn crazy. He did not only stab and kill the woman in her 60s to death, but he first grabbed and killed the damn dog. Who would do that, man? Are you telling me that mental health? This is why the CDC has been talking about getting ready for the zombie apocalypse. Because the way this crazy shit is starting to happen, this is the road that it looks like we're going down. I don't know if it's going to be zombies, but it's just going to be a whole bunch of crazy motherfuckers. I'd rather it probably be zombies, because if it's just, these zombies move slow. If it's just some crazy motherfucker who can move fast and regular like normal people, we in trouble. Why would you just walk up to this 60-something-year-old uh, lady, grab her dog, and start stabbing her damn dog, then turn around and stab her to death, and you got the b to do that, and then you turn around and let some somebody knock you unconscious? <laughs> Why I tell you, man, only in America... Only in America, man. Right? You got enough damn to walk in broad daylight and stab somebody to death and kill their goddamn dog. But you so damn weak that you let somebody just beat you up and knock you out. It says a woman in her 60s was stabbed to death along with her dog in a horrifying daylight attack in Los Angeles Park, which ended when a passerby knocked her killer unconscious with a rock. The woman has not been named, nor has the 23-year-old predator. He was described by police as a Hispanic male. The attack, thank God it wasn't nobody but Black. Uh, man, I'm half Puerto Rican too, but damn, it don't matter. I got see, I got a bad boat, but it don't matter if it's a black or, or, or Hispanic. I'm still hit. Let me see if I got some more here. It says the woman was walking her dog. First, he grabbed her dog's leash from her and started stabbing the animal. Once he had killed the animal, he started attacking the woman. The first man he approached saw what was happening when he rushed back to help. He picked up a rock and hit the man over the head with it. He was knocked unconscious. The woman and the dog were both pronounced dead at the scene and the attacker was taken to the hospital. He is expected to be discharged from the hospital today and booked into jail on a murder charge. When medically cleared, the suspect will be transported to the San Dimas station and booked for murder, the sheriff's department said in a statement. There's no picture of him as of yet. If I get a picture later on down the line, I will do an update. I thought they had a photo, but I guess because they haven't booked him in jail yet when this story released, so I don't have the mugshot. But there will be a mugshot that I will provide it. So he tried to stab another man that man got away. Then he randomly picks up, sees the 60, the woman in her 60s, grabs the dog by the leash, kills the dog, then kills and stabs her. Then the man who got away that he tried to stab the first time came back to beat him over the head with a damn rock and knocked him out. And then the police got him. What a goddamn crazy ass story. And why the hell is you in the park just stabbing random goddamn people? You ain't robbing them. You didn't say they was trying to get no money. Like, why is you just in the park stabbing people, random people, man? You couldn't kill the man, so you go and kill the lady. Something's not going on in society right now. <laughs> the world is going nuts. No, the world ain't going nuts. That motherfucker just went nuts. It ain't the world that went nuts. His ass went nuts. Because I'm saying, I think, if me and you think that shit crazy, and I mean, I'm part of the world, and you part of the world, so the world ain't gone nuts. That don't went nuts. The hell is you doing just walking in the park, randomly picking up people to stab to death? And obviously, it was no motive because he tried to just stab some other random person. That person gets the hell away. Then he goes back and kills the damn lady and the dog and the person who got away. Oh, this shit, this shit's crazy, man. I can't, I wish I had some photos because I want to see what the person that hit him with the rock. <laughs> Hey, it's a tragic story, and I'm not laughing at anything that have to do with the events of the story, except for the fact that his ass got knocked out by the dude he tried to stab the first time that beat him in the head with the rock. I would love to see what the dude that hit him in that... I said, did it say he threw the rock? Yeah, it said he threw the rock. He didn't even hit him in the head with the rock. I would love to see what the dude looked like that threw the, threw the rock and knocked him out. 
He said he wasn't going close to his ass because he's stabbing people. But he threw the damn rock and knocked him out. He must have threw that damn rock hard as hell. And that, that's crazy as hell, man. San Dimas way too close to my to to my bro's home. Yeah, well, that's where it happened at. Just randomly. Glad, thank God your brother wasn't walking in the damn park. You need to go check. Maybe your brother might be the one that hit him in the head with the damn rock. You need to call your damn brother. I know it. It say he's Hispanic. Hold on. I think the man who did the stabbing was Hispanic. You need to go call and check on your brother and make sure he wasn't part of this damn story. You know how you damn Me the Mexicans is. <laughs> You need to check on his ass and make sure his ass, it wasn't him. <laughs> you know how them goddamn cartel Mexicans is, D. Lucy D. I know how them cartel Mexicans is. Shit crazy, man. People are lost their damn minds. I don't know. I think it's the COVID fatigue. 